Hi, Dr. Malka here, your chiropractor and acupuncturist practicing in Los Angeles, California. And in this video, I'm going to tell you how my husband decreased his blood pressure without medication. First off, he had a few extra pounds to lose. So through exercise, nothing crazy. He walked or hiked maybe 30 minutes a day each day and he started eating healthy, which means I made him eat his veggies. <laughs> I also incorporated flaxseed in his diet, either in his salad, yogurt, or in his warm food, because flaxseed doesn't really have a strong taste, so it won't interfere with the flavor. There are several vitamins that are found in the following foods that can be helpful to decrease blood pressure also. And I'm gonna list these at the end of the video. So foods that are high in vitamin C, like kiwis, citrus, broccoli, and strawberries. Foods high in vitamin E, like almonds, peanuts, avocados, and wild caught salmon. Foods high in potassium, like potatoes, bananas, tomatoes, and carrots. And foods high in calcium, found in dairy products, or for my vegans, dark green leafy veggies, broccoli, beans, and peas. Decreasing alcohol and quitting smoking will help as well. Stress is really not my husband's issue, but that can also increase blood pressure. And I can't recommend the Calm app enough. And even some health insurance pay for the app because it's so effective in decreasing stress. It's an app that has simple beginning meditation and relaxation techniques. And as you progress, it progresses with you. So basically it caters to your needs. Also 10 deep breaths in and out through your nose during stressful situations can help. And just in general, breathing through your nose helps to decrease blood pressure. So let's breathe together. So of course you can do these breaths sitting, but I'm gonna show you lying down because one important part of deep breathing is to do belly breaths and not breathe with the chest. So, you know, we live in a culture where you suck your tummy in to look thin, and then we end up being chest breathers. So we're gonna ch change that up a little bit. So what I want you to do is put your hand on your chest and one hand on your belly, and you're gonna breathe in through your nose and out through your nose. And you're gonna focus on just rising your belly. So you can even hover your hands above your belly about one inch and then breathe in, touching your hand and breathe out. Breathe in. And I'm gonna do this for a minute with you and breathe out. Breathing in. Breathing out. And you can see how I'm not lifting my chest at all. And at first this might feel tight for you, but as you keep practicing it, these abdominal muscles will loosen up. So basically when you're breathing, you're stretching out your abdominal muscles. So if the information in this video is helpful, please subscribe. And if you have any other questions about high blood pressure and how to decrease it, just leave it in the comments below.
We will be launching a new YouTube video every Wednesday and Friday at 3 p.m. And I'll be available for any questions you have or suggestions for future videos.